Hey everybody, here's a tutorial on how to import footage from a camera card into Final Cut Pro 10. The first thing I'm going to do is start a brand new library. I'm going to go up to the file menu, go to new library. It's going to ask me what to call the library and I'm going to call it practice. And I'm going to save it right to my desktop and I'll click save and think of a library as a container. All the footage is going to go in there, all our work is going to go in there and it's going to house all our work. And I have my new library right up here in the upper left hand corner and inside that is a new event. And you can have multiple events inside a library but all the footage is going to go into those events. And it's going to title this new event uh, whatever today's date is. And also on the right hand side of the screen the inspector opened up and this is uh, asking me where I want to save the footage. Uh, I'm just going to uh, save it, everything inside the library for now. And I'll close my inspector. As soon as you pop a camera card into the computer and Final Cut 10 is running, the media import window will automatically open. And I don't have a card, but I do have a disk image of a card. I'm going to double click on it. and the media import window in Final Cut just opened up. And it's giving me a view of all the clips that were on that card. And I can skim through them with my skimmer, which is always on my mouse. I can look at them in film strip view, or in list view. I can select one of those clips, and I can tap the up and down arrow keys to look through them. but I like looking at them in film strip view. Now I want to make sure I import all the clips on this card. Right now I only have one clip selected, this one with the yellow border. But if I click over here where there isn't any clip and deselect it, this button says import all. As soon as you click on one or a few clips, the button changes to import selected. So if you want to make sure to import all the clips on a card, you don't have to select any of them and Final Cut 10 will automatically think that you want to import all the clips. Now I want to add it to this, uh, this event right here, uh, 10115, we can always change the name later. And we have a couple options here, copy to library or leave files in place. Well actually we only have one option when we're copying from a card. Final Cut 10 is not going to give us the option to just leave the files in place because the place it will be leaving them is the card, it has to copy them off the card and uh, I'll leave everything else here unchecked for now and I'll click import all and it shouldn't take too long and now all those clips are inside the library and that's it